So this is a fun little project that I've been wanting to do for a long time but never had the chance to bring it to life and I'm really happy that I managed to do it because it's such a nostalgic product for me. As a child I used to receive this gift which was a little suitcase that had a bunch of art supplies and stationery and it would also include these cute stickers that didn't have any coloring and you could color them anything you wanted and it was just the most fun thing for me as a child and I have the best memories so of course I had to create my own version as an adult so this project means so much to me and I really hope you enjoy it as well this week has been very productive but also a little bit challenging I'm trying to navigate some issues that I'm dealing with. So as you probably know, I've been struggling with planning, organizing and managing my time. And after so long, I managed to find the perfect system that I'm very happy with. And that has actually helped me to be way more productive and be able to work on all of the creative projects that I want. But at the same time, Perhaps my schedule has become too rigid to the point that if something goes wrong, which it does daily, <laughs> right? If something goes wrong, like for example, being interrupted or just by a simple phone call or someone just requiring my attention, because I also work from home. So it's very easy for people to reach me or of course they feel very comfortable calling me because they know that I work from home. So <laughs> it's okay to answer phone calls. But at the same time, it's just so challenging for me because when I'm in the zone trying to work on something and trying to focus, if something interrupts that, I have trouble focusing back on it. So I've been trying to navigate that in a way. And it has a lot to do with boundaries, which is also something I've always struggled with. I try to be polite with people. I try to be nice. I don't want to be aggressive or reject people. But at the same time, I realize that I have to protect my time and also how precious my time is because I do have a full-time job right so and I'm also a creative person that has a small business and countless countless hobbies so for me being able to fit everything in my day plus the interruptions it's just been very challenging and many times it's disorienting as well. It's just very frustrating when you're in the zone and somebody requires your attention and is demanding things or needs help from you or it's just, I love to help people. I absolutely love that. But when it's at the wrong time, it just, it can really have a very negative impact on my life. And it's something that I'm trying to actively manage right now. But besides that, this week has been very productive i'm very happy with everything i've done this week and i'm happy to announce that the latest schedule or as i call it timeline actually works for me and it's so amazing so basically what i do is to split my schedule into two parts so essentially i work a few hours in the morning and then a few hours at night and since my schedule is very flexible. I work with a timer so I can just pause anytime I want and continue work when I choose to essentially, which I feel very grateful for. It has helped me so much because it was always a struggle for me. I would see my most productive hours being wasted in a way and it just felt so frustrating that I have to spend those hours working instead of creating. So now I feel that I am claiming my time back. I'm claiming my most productive hours. And those are essentially between 11 and 3 p.m. Sometimes 10 as well, depending on how early I wake up. So splitting my schedule was the answer all along. I've never tried it before until now, even though I've been working on a flexible schedule for three years now. But yeah, I'm so, so grateful that this is working for me and I can finally 
put those productive hours towards my personal dream and my passion. And not just that, it's also about self-care and resting and spending the day away from an office essentially because spending like six or eight hours in front of the pc like non-stop that was just insane for me it just feels very unnatural and it made me so freaking bored i couldn't handle that so now with this split schedule i can focus on what i love doing and spend my time the way that i want to spend it instead of being told how to spend it so for me this has been life-changing and i wish everybody could have this i'm a huge advocate for working from home i understand that most jobs are not eligible for that because sometimes you really need to be present in the work environment but i do believe there's so many benefits to working from home i do believe that any job that is done on a computer and doesn't require your physical presence i think should turn into a work from home job at the very least i think office jobs should be flexible with a couple of days from home and the biggest reason is that life is unpredictable right so it's kind of unrealistic i know we've been doing this for years and decades everybody has been going to the office and working there but life is so unpredictable and having a flexible schedule that you can work around life events is so precious i don't understand why we have to be so rigid about this specific thing of course sometimes having structure helps a lot of people but i think people like me who are more creative and less conventional in a way it works perfectly so i at the very least i think everybody should have the option of doing that of course i'm referring to office jobs that can actually be turned into work from home jobs so yeah I'm, I'm a huge advocate for that and it has really changed my life personally i think i, I could go on and on about how working from home is life-changing and how many benefits there are to it but i'm pretty sure everybody knows at this point because during the last crisis that we had many people were in a position to try working from home and i think at this point everybody knows how amazing it is and at the very least to be flexible at your job i'm very grateful that this has worked for me and i feel very lucky to be in this position and the biggest reason is that if i'm not creative every day i can get very grumpy to me at this point it's an essential way of living it's an essential lifestyle choice and i don't think i will ever go back to working from an office so yeah for now this is perfect and i feel very grateful and very lucky and especially this week has been such a huge success for me so yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one